good neighbor's crazy. Thefts, murders, worse. Sometimes you just gotta escape a little to make it through the day. Escape? What do you mean? Reliving old memories. Like Thanksgiving, 2071. Mom made a 12-pound turkey. And then we all listened to the Silver Shroud vs. Captain Cosmos. Even Pa was there. You ever listened to the Silver Shroud? Huh. That's what we need. No matter how bleak things got, he saved the day. What can you tell me about the Shroud? He's from the radio shows. I've listened to all 419 episodes. And the holiday special. He's the best. Better than Grognak and Man-to-Man -Man combined. That sounds familiar. You'd remember him if you heard his show. They're the best detective shows in the whole world. What if the Silver Shroud was real? With his black trench coat and gleaming silver submachine gun? I got a plan to bring him to life. So we can fight bad guys and give the rest of us a symbol of something better. What plan? I've built my own custom machine gun. Even better than the one in the show. But to make this work, I still need the most important piece. The genuine Silver Shroud costume herself. And they actually got one here in Boston. They made it for the TV show. Will you help? I might do it, if you make it worth my while. When you're done, I got a reward all squared away. Will you just help me out? Do you really need the costume? With the gun, I'm just another armed hooligan. But if the Silver Shroud came to life and helped people, it would give everyone hope. I'll get the costume for you. You're gonna do this? For real? Before the bombs fell, they were filming the Silver Shroud pilot over at Hubris Comics. So that's where you'll find it. You're the best. Kent. There she is, pretty as the posters. The Silver Shroud costume herself. Together with my gun, everything's all set. What are you planning next? I'm still working that out. Some details I want to run by you. Well, after you give me the costume, that is. First the reward, then I'll give you the costume. Here. I wasn't gonna Welsh on our deal. After all these years. The Silver Shroud is born again. But there's just one problem. I'm just not Silver Shroud material. I could be Rhett Reinhardt, or, or his butler Jarvey Blake. But the Shroud is strong, capable. That's the first sane thing you've said. Yeah, yeah. But I, I do have a better idea who should wear it. You up for being a Silver Shroud? You're just like him. Except you probably haven't been in a blimp shot down by mobsters. If I go along with this, I could use a little extra. If it'll get you to help, sure. I, I, I may be able to scrounge up a couple of things. Why me? No one else would help me find the costume. Even though it sounds crazy, you can't. The whole world's fallen. Fallen hard. We gotta fight to make the place better. So you in? Looks like I get to be the Shroud. The costume and gun are yours. So you patrol good neighbor's streets, and I'll call in any crimes on my radio station. Here's some calling cards, I guess. When you dispatch justice, leave them behind. That way, everyone knows the Silver Shroud has returned. Time to fight crime! Silver Shroud fans, a once-in-a-lifetime announcement. The Silver Shroud returns and he's gonna clean up the streets. Everyone heard how Wayne Delancey murdered Miss 
sell me and her kid over a few lousy caps. Death is coming for you, Wayne. Galaxy News Radio. Holy moly, a silver shroud in the flesh. Oh no, death is coming for me. <laughs> That a silver shroud costume? Hey, uh, no judgment. But ain't that a kid show? Dispatched justice already. Miss Selmy has been avenged. Shit, the shroud off Wayne? Wait, so this guy's actually for real? Oh, you better believe it. You know who kicked the ghouls out of Diamond City? So, Jerry, right? go on. Tell the listeners it. about what we're talking about. He'll get his one day. Right. So, AJ, you know the chem dealer by Bobby's. He's doing it. Never been to kill or be killed. Says he's got a whole new market. Weapons. Kids. Even with his garbage camps, he's just breaking in the caps. You hear that? Sounds like the Silver Shroud has another bad guy to deal with. Uh, why? This Shroud guy, he's gonna muscle in on the chem trade now? No. He's gonna do something about it. AJ's selling the kids, and his chems have k killed people. And? I don't get it. We can't let AJ kill kids. Whatever. Galaxy News Radio. Justice to good neighbor. You bad guys better look out. And now, a special update. The villainous assassin Kendra was recently spotted at the third rail. The same Kendra who bombed little Joe Shack and killed four innocent drifters. If you want to see the Silver Shroud in action, stay near Whitechapel Charlie. 
The Shroud's sure to interrogate him to find the evildoer's whereabouts. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man look. Entertainment down the stairs. Silver Shroud. I seek a miscreant named Kendra. Shroud, then? Well, I'm nothing. Kendra is not one to be trifled with. People associated with her have a habit of being found face down in a ditch. You're set on meeting her, for a fee it can be arranged. Can you spare a few details on her, at least? On the house? You got to have finesse to be an assassin. Kendra's a murderer. A very skilled murderer. Listen, mate, the combat scan shows you know what you're all about. Save your caps by a logger instead. It is not wise to stand between the Silver Shroud and righteous justice. <laughs> justice? <laughs> you mean to end her? In that case, her flat's just south of Good Neighbor. Water Street Apartments. Yeah, for the blighters she's got with her. Nasty piece of business, then. Good luck. Need a place to stay? Try Hotel Rexford. Can't go forward, can't go back. You must be Kendra. And you, you're the crazy one in the costume. Wayne Delancey's killer. You have no idea who you're dealing with. I do so like it when the little bug crawls willingly into the spider's webs. Are you an assassin? No. I'm paid to make big, bold statements. 
Don't screw with us. If you do, you and everyone around you dies. You have taken your last life, villain. You stole my line. <laughs> Update. No, it wasn't Bobby No Nose who walked AJ and his goons. It was the Silver Shroud. See his calling card if you don't believe me. Now's our time, listeners. Justice is coming, a good neighbor. You'll see. Another headliner. Hancock seeks a special meeting with our hero, the Silver Shroud. Whatever it's about, be careful, Shroud. We're all with you. Galaxy News! Radio! You ever tried chess? Sometimes you need to sacrifice a piece to keep the game going. Keep that in mind. Guess what someone tells me? Some costume freak is operating in Good Neighbor. And the kicker is, it ain't me. How should I feel about this? Have I crossed the line? I don't know. Let's recap. You've been busy scaring people, bashing in a few faces. I respect that, so far. But I gotta ask, one freak to another, why the getup? Many have sought to pierce the shroud to no avail. You just don't stop. <laughs> Stay you, pal. The lowlifes you took out all belong to the same asshole, and that asshole's planning some old-fashioned revenge on you. You dig? Fortunate for you, I want Sinjin to take a dirt nap. He's taken two Bit Raider outfits and made them scary. Small fish now, but if left alone... What do you know about him? Leveled some farms, napalmed his own men and a couple enemies. But besides his dark deeds, Nobody knows nothing. If he ain't dealt with now, in a couple of years, it may take an army to end him. Why are you telling me this? If I get involved, it gets complicated. But you, nobody knows who the hell you are. Just some lunatic taking out trash. And if you buy it, none of this comes back to me. He will be judged for his crimes. Trust me. He needs a lot of judging. Got a lead on two of his own. Smiling Kate and Northy. Smiley is gathering a posse to take you out. And Northy is just running scared. Hired himself some goons and is holding up in prospect. Just keep piling those body bags up until you find the location of the big guy himself. Getting rid of Sinjin helps you too. Some appreciation is in order. I'm doing you the favor, pal. Sinjin's got a powerful hate of brewing, but you deal with Sinjin, and I'm inclined to show you some gratitude, you feel me? We didn't get to the top of this town by playing fair. <clears throat> got a lot on my mind. Excuse me.
Oh, it's you. Oh, sugar. I told Kent all that hero stuff was going to get you both killed. Oh, God. Oh, God. What happened to Kent? Where is he? They... They took him. Raiders. Nothing but bloodlust in their eyes. We... We couldn't stop them. When they took him away, they left you a message. Just listen to Kent's radio station. It keeps playing it over and over again. Here's a Silver Shroud update. In case you missed it, Kendra's reign of terror is over. She won't be... What? Oh, God, what's happening? On your knees, dirtbag. What? What are you doing? What? Ah! Sinjin, all clear. This is the Shroud's headquarters. So you must be the Silver Shroud's little friend. Yes. Don't do it, Shroud. It's a trap. Save yourself. Ah! Oh! Oh my God! Do it, Shroud! Do it! On my knee! Ah! Tick tock, Shroud. Don't keep me waiting. We got business that needs finishing. Here's a silver shroud. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. Stop, die. 
Anyone turns heel, I'm coming for you and your family. And you, Shroud, you step any closer, and we get to see what's inside Kent's head. You shield yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin. And you shall fall before me. Don't talk to me like that. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. <laughs> like you walk straight out of a comic book. You and I know. You're human. 
And you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? I have cut a path through all your thugs. Who can truly say I'm not the Shroud? Don't listen, man. He's a phony. So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then, I'm going to Good Neighbor and kill every last worthless bastard there and burn the whole thing down. No one screws with Sinjin. What happens is this. Everyone that points a gun at me dies. Every last one. Nice try. <laughs> but they fear me more than they'll ever fear a loser like you. Say goodnight, Kent. <laughs> The deed is done. The dreaded Sinjin breathes no more. All by your lonesome, you took down the big bad Sinjin. We get to walk that tight rope of freedom one more day. Take this for the effort. You played your part in serving justice to those most deserving of it. I'm gonna miss these little conversations. Gutter's been running a little too red lately. You keep them clean, and you're welcome back anytime. Try chess. Sometimes you need to sacrifice a piece to keep the game going. Keep that in mind. 